Hello everybody, it's I, the, Will the Willowigi Big Mac, and welcome back to Psychonauts. Last time, uh, last time we completed the rest of, uh, we helped Edgar get over his, uh, bull problem. And, uh, well, now, and now we're helping, uh, we are now helping, uh, Fred Bonaparte, uh, beat his, uh, his, uh, mind ancestor version of of uh, Napoleon Bonaparte. Interest interesting how how he's actually related. Alrighty then. And we got more confused that confusion grenade ammo, which is something which is exactly what we needed, by the way. Anyway, time to move on to the next area we need to head to head over to, which is down this way. Hey, don't touch my pieces. Anyway, we got to go down here now. Anyway, time for some acrobatics. Did we even grab the first tag? We did not. That's how we get right here. And then from here, we can step on this bad boy here. No, no, no. Start climbing on this pole. There we go. That'll serve you, right? Barely made it. I believe this is the last one. So that's the streamer tag. We're still missing the uh, the purse tag. might also help if I set this on fire. Hey, look, a musket. I'll bet I can arm our troops with that. Oh, we got a wise guy here, huh? There it is. Well, that was easy. And we got ourselves another, uh, we got ourselves another extra life. 
Because believe me, because believe me, we're going to need them for, uh... We are going to need all the lives we can get for, uh, for the next level we're about to do. Because, whoo we Quite the annoying level we got to deal with. Now we no longer now we no longer need to be in the building. Also, you go in the ocean. <laughs> Just ow. Also, welcome oh you get out of here. I'm going to try and get rid of... Anyway. There we go. Die, you asshole. Alright. Good thing, good thing, uh, good thing you're given a little bounce, uh, for, uh, any of the water stuff. Got that's all the metal cobwebs. Anyways. Thanks for blocking that shot, the uh, old safe friend. Fred versus Napoleon. So, anyway, Fred here kept losing to Crispin. And it calls him to go insane. He starts seeing the, uh, he starts seeing uh, Napoleon in his mirror. And Napoleon starts strangling him. Also, you there. You. Get out of here. Watch him drown. Uh, -huh, yes, it's, it's really funny. You are an, you're an asshole. Now, you might be wondering why I'm going around here and dealing with all this. Uh, yeah, because this part's kind of annoying if you don't uh, deal with all the enemies. Like, if you, if you kind of let all the enemies live, they are just going to, like, they are going to, these guys will actually, like, fuck you up. Like, I'm not even joking. Like, they will actually uh, pulverize you into a bloody pulp if you're, uh, if you're not careful. And as far as we know, enemies don't respawn. Where did that come from? Anyways. One last thing before we, uh... Let's get this guy. Hello. I'm recruiting soldiers for the army of the caring and generous Fred Bonaparte. 
Weapon. What? Weapon. That's what I want. I'm not gonna die like the others, okay? That's the spirit. You get me my special musket, and I'll come out. I think I left it buried in some hay in that heavily guarded building over there. Uh, yeah, what hay? And, and uh... Then I'll sign up and kill me some Napoleon lovers, got it? Be right back. Okay, there's your special musket. Ready? All right, now I'm all set to go rob that stupid carpenter. What? I got you that gun so you could fight Napoleon's army, not the carpenter. I've been trying to break into his house for days now, but he's always got a fire going, so I can't get down his chimney. <laughs> could you just fight this one lousy soldier first? He's kind of in the way anyway. Okay, but just as practice. Where is he? Man, man, this guy's bloodthirsty. Reiki. Uh, let's see. Do you have help? Yes, you do. Hey. Ow. Nice try, pal. You missed. Cool musket, huh? Oh, wait. Have to reload here. Die. Uh, I kill you. There we go. I, how? Retreat! Everyone into the stronghold! Rise the drawbridge! Immediate ball! Jam the mechanism with something! Anything! Hey! You can't jam the gears! That's cheating! All is fair in love and war! You have fought well! But that's as far as you shall go, my friend! Ha! We'll see about that! Fred? Was that you? Yeah! Come on! We're winning! All we have to do is unjam those gears! <laughs> I'm on it, General! See, that's... See, no! Now we got Fred in the mood. We're gonna place this guy here. And then all we have to do is uh let's just move him right. Okay, please don't tell me that the enemies respawned. Cool, they did not. I think I think the devs realized that having those uh, cannon enemies respawn right here would have not been very cool. Thanks, thanks for your help, Water. Just go here. Ah, damn it. And this is why people, and, th and that's the other reason why people do not like uh, this section of this level. Give me your health. that thing out of here now before we now before we do anything uh, 
Break this right here for more health. Collect all these figments here, break all these things, try and get more health. And more ammo, because we could definitely use the ammo as well. Break that open. And let's go storm here. Ta-da! That was easy. Stronghold stormed, game one. Oh, you have to storm the stronghold with your knight, you stupid fool. Oh. You stupid fool. Alright, now let's actually win the game. Your walls are no thicker than the crust of a creme brulee. Behold the mighty tapping of my spoon. And there we go, we won the game. What? What is this? Fred! Did you do this? Huh? What? I can't believe it! You! You are a Bonaparte! There is some Napoleon in your veins after all. Well, m maybe. Finally, I can resign myself back to my glorious history. The future is yours, Fred Bonaparte. You are indeed a true warrior. Go forth and fight all your battles with the same determination you showed here, and your life will be an endless parade of victories, like mine. Yes, well, except for that last one. The one, one in Waterloo. Waterloo. Mm, I was sick that day. Very bad stomach cramp, let me tell you. That's why I've always got my hand tucked in here, you know? <laughs> You'll find out when you're older. It's uh, hereditary. It's hereditary? Oh. Is he really gone? Hello? Hello? Anyone else in here? Ah, we did it, Raz. I'm all me again. One person, not French. Get me out of this dang jacket so I can go strangle me in orderly. Hey, good thinking, Fred. That sure would save me a lot of work. Yep. Right after I take a nap. Yes. Uh, what? Nap? <sighs> War is hell, Rasputin. And I am sleepy. Uh, I'll take care of Crispin for you. Just as soon as I... Alrighty. If I recall correctly, we have a few brains we have to return. So, first thing, now, now I did, now, I believe we can check, let's see, brains, why? Yeah, we got all the brains in this area. Anyway. Okay, what's the situation? Let's regroup, regroup uh, back at HQ. Affirmative. Prepare for extraction. Cause we need we need we need to get ourselves some more health. Uh, but first, before we do that, let's hop down here. Cause I believe with this thing right here. Yep, we can create a bunch of side cards. Let's see how much we can make. We can make about four. Now we just have to head over here. And then we're, we're going to make a pit stop at the uh, school store real quick. Okay, 
Here's the plan. I'm gonna go get on the coach's radio and call for help. See, now that's an excellent idea. Why can't everyone be so helpful? Yeah, I modified the antenna, so now it broadcasts straight into outer space. Her and so, her space. Is Elton okay? Well, he'll be fully brained soon. I promise. When he comes out, tell him I'm waiting for him down by the docks, okay? Hey, do you want to help us save the... Typical. Yep. And that's why finding your brain in particular was my highest priority. You know, I'll bet if JT wasn't so distracted, this wouldn't have happened. He's probably with that prissy little show pony right now. No. Actually, I think her mind's on other things at the moment. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll go see what's up. One of us at least should be guarding the sleeping quarters. Agent Cruller? What is the current situation? I'd better go. Huh? Anyways. Let's, uh, let's, let's go, uh... Let's go buy yourself some, create yourself some uh, challenge markers. So that didn't go according to plan. God, thank God for levitation being stupid busted in Where this game. Like oh. And then, uh, you know what? You know what? We'll also show off the cutscene uh, with Linda when you call her. Like, off, like obviously, it's the longer way to get back over there. But we might as well show off the cutscene hey, at least once. Anything new in the store? Take a look. Now with that, you can change now. You take that side car there. I'll take it. Sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Now I'll take it. Excellent choice. What else can I do you for? Excellent choice. What else can I do you for? Take it. Alrighty then. What else can I do you for? Let's see. Mm. All right. That's it for now. All right. Go get more. Air. Let's just head. Let's just head back to uh, HQ. Make our uh, make our size. Make our challenge markers uh, right here. And we got the offensive shield. Excellent. That actually will be useful uh, for a little upcoming boss fight that well a certain boss fight N definitely upcoming but not the upcoming one uh, anyway let's let's go ahead to the lake so we can show off that cutscene yes Anyway, when we use this lungfish call, there she is. What's up, Linda? Prepare yourself for passage, human child. And into the math we go. And just like that. Now, now we're back over here.
Let's go talk to uh, Fred real quick while he's taking his nap. Hey, Fred. Well, luckily for us, we have everything we need to progress. We got the Lobato. We got that. And there we go. Greetings, Dr. Lobato. Good to see your face. I see you're wearing your favorite jacket. If I may say so, your claw is looking especially menacing today. Up to the secret laboratory then, is it? Taking her up yourself this time, eh, Doctor? Less work for me. Inmate Look. Whitehead. Chief Orderly Bonaparte. You're... you're... Armed? armed. <laughs> Well, here I am, up in the tower of an abandoned insane asylum, wearing a straitjacket, talking to myself. Okay, enough with the disguise. The things I do for Lily's brain. Well, if I'm going to get to the top of this thing, I'd better start hiking. And hiking we shall start to do. Now, we're, there are a lot of brains here. Hmm, I wonder who that is. Uh-oh, rats! Also, these rats hurt. They hurt like a fucking bitch. So, yeah. Avoid the rats at all times. Let's see. And we can just go through here. And we got ourselves a brain. Benny. <laughs> they thought it would be smaller. Again, I still don't get why he kisses the brains. Wouldn't that be disgusting? Getting all those all that brain juice over your lips. Ugh. It's giving me the heebie jeebies just thinking about it. Ah jeez, more rats, more rats. There we go. Serves your rights, rats. Anyway, we cannot climb up on that. then if I recall correctly I think we have to go up here actually actually on my phone I actually have the page up that has all the ones we're looking for so right over in the lower tower so there's one two three four five six seven eight so there's about nine braids we have to look out for we already found one Have to look for number two. Speak of the devil, and I'm assuming it's Bobby. I didn't know you had a brain. <laughs> Man, I wish you were here for that joke, Bobby. I mean, I mean, if I were you, I, I would just spit on the brain. Because that guy, because that guy's a dick. We don't, we don't like Bobby here, folks. But I will say. It's always it's always funny uh, dunking on on uh Something tells me this is the correct way to go.
Nothing, nothing else here, I see. Ah, jeez, where are they coming from? Die! Get out of here! I don't like this! Now, this is when things start to get a bit strange. Because we have all this right here. Looks like we're gonna have to buy ourselves some more, uh, uh, core so we can get some more, uh, challenge markers in. We have ourselves another brain here. Alpha do. Maybe I should let JT have some time alone before I return this brain. Uh, anyways. How do we get up there? Uh, duh. What? Excuse me? And this is what's probably what most most of the rest of the episode is probably going to be. Just us. Or, well, I say us. Really, it's me. Uh, me just doing the platforming here. Don't you dare fall off this time. Raz. And we have enough to make another uh, challenge marker, so yay! More challenge markers. Yep. Where are you, you rat bastards? God, those rats are annoying. Thank God. So back, so back when I was playing through this game on my own, I never bothered with the uh, Psy rank ups. So I had to waste a lot of ammo killing these rats. Speak of the devil. Also, lovely camera angles, am I right? Alrighty then. Another card here. Let's see. Just going to be doing a bit of exploring here. Fun fact, your, uh, your levitation ball actually lights up the area. I believe we hop on the bed. No, we don't. Hmm. This one we do. Okay, that time we have to use like three ammo because they, because a bunch of them spawned at once. Thank you, game. Also, who's that? Who's that weird lady? They keep shrieking at us. I hope he's on a banshee or something. I cannot tell what the heck she she's supposed to be. And welcome to the slime pit, folks. This is where all your favorite Nickelodeon shows come to die. Ow! God, these rats are fucking annoying. I'm jumping down here. Oh, don't tell me. It fucking despawned. Son of a bitch. Alrighty, well. I see a brain over here. That we need to grab. Also, how are we not falling through? But that's besides the point. We have the... I love it when my A press don't work. Ah, classic, my classic Xbox controller just not doing what I wanted to do. Uh, 
Grab onto the fucking ledge, Raz. God, it shouldn't. It, sh it should not be this fucking difficult. Just, just to, just to fucking grab on this, just to get this brain. Like, come on. There we go. Yo, Quentin. I'm just bad at the game. And ready. So that's four brains. So that's a full. Uh, so that's a another whole uh, heart slot because we take like four damage. Because each we take because there's like because each brain gets split in four on our health. Ah, excellent. We can climb. We can climb on this. There you go. Oh, come on! God. God, I love. I love. God, I love it when rats respawn for zero reason. Man, don't you love it when, when the rats respawn? All jokes aside, I think this is... Right here, I feel like this is the weakest point of the game. Because the platforming is... Not the... It's not the best. Not the best platforming uh, out there. Uh, dare I say... Uh, frustrating as hell as well. Mainly, mainly because, uh, just mainly because, uh, majority of the time you're, uh, dealing with rats, where when they explode on you, you just take a shit ton of damage for no reason, on top of the fact that you get, that your, uh, brain gets all confused and everything. Yep. Speak of the devils, here comes rats! More rats! Gotta love rats! They're here for another birthday bash! Luckily, as long as you can get some distance from them, they aren't too obnoxious. And we have our next brain over here. Hey, Stogan! Stogan Pool. I told you I'd get your brain back. <sighs> Alright, hopefully those rats don't come back. I'm already here. I'm already hearing them. What the? This this lady has some freaky freaky teleporting powers. Let's see, is there anything down here? Yes, another brain. Huh. Phoebe's brain is warmer than the others. Alrighty, so I believe that's six brains we got. Yep, that's six brains. There's like three more left in this area, but yeah, there's there's like three more left in this area. I see another one right here.
Ow! God, no reason for those rats to, to hurt like a fucking bitch. Anyway, there's... Yeah, this is probably the easiest way of doing that. Yay! Woohoo! Crystals rain. Let's hear it for Thinky. Good camera angles, game. Good camera angles. Love the camera angles. Uh, you know, you know it's a 2000s game when the when the camera angles just aren't the best. Alrighty, you know what? I'm just going to end the episode here. Just a bit early because I don't feel like walking all the way up. Back up there. Alrighty then, if you guys enjoyed the episode, please consider subscribing as uh, I'll really appreciate it. Uh, uh, comment, like, uh, you know, be sure to subscribe, comment, leave a like, you know, help help YouTube shitty algorithm push the video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next episode where we're going to be continuing to climb this terrible, terrible tower. Until then, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye. <laughs>